Hello, in this video we solve a nice algebra problem x square minus y square equals to 19. How do we now find the value of x and y? Solution x square minus y square can be written as x plus y times x minus y equals to 19. This is just a difference of two square. Now, let's consider 19. We can write 19 as 19 times 1 or we write 19 as 1 times 19. First, we are going to consider the first case. When 19 is equal to 19 times 1, that means from here we are going to get x plus y times x minus y equals to, so we replace 19 with this guy, 19 times 1, which implies that x plus y is equals to 19 corresponding values and x minus y is equals to 1. These two equations can be added. So when we add, we're going to have x plus x that is 2x, y minus y that is 0 equals to 19 plus 1 that is simply 20. Let's divide both sides by 2. So we're going to have 2x over 2 equals to 20 over 2. 2 cancels 2. So we have x equals to 20 over 2 that is simply 10. So the value of x is equals to 10. Now to obtain the value of y, we are going to substitute the value of x into any of this equation. Let's substitute the value of x into this equation. So we're going to have 10 plus y equals to 19. So y is equals to 19. When this guy comes to the right, that is negative 10. So y is equals to 19 minus 10, that is 9. So the value of y is equals to 9. Thus, s comma y is equals to what is x s is 10 comma what is y that is 9 so this is the first solution now let's consider the second case so that means that means we are going to replace 19 with 1 times 19 from this line we're going to have x plus y times x minus y equals to this guy 1 times 19 which implies that x plus y is equals to 1 and x minus y is equals to 19 corresponding values. So adding these two equations, x plus x that is 2x, y minus y that is 0 equals to 1 plus 19 that is simply 20. Dividing both sides by 2, we're going to have 2x over 2 equals to 20 over 2. So x is equals to 10. To obtain the value of y, let's plug the value of x into any of this equation. Suppose we plug it here, we're going to have 10 plus y equals to 1, which implies that y is equals to 1. When this guy comes to the right, that is minus 10. So the value of y is equals to negative 9. So does second solution, x comma y, is equals to what is x? x is 10 and y is negative 9. Now let us check if what we've done is right. Recall from the original question it says x square minus y square is equals to 19. Let's consider this first solution. x is 10 and y is 9. So we are going to plug it here. So we're gonna have 10 square minus 9 square, which is equals to 10 squared that is 10 times 10, which is 100, minus 9 squared that is simply 81. 100 minus 81, that is equals to 19, which is what we have on the right hand side. This solution is true. Now let's check for the second solution. So we are going to plug the value of x, which is 10, here, and y, which is negative 9, into this guy. So we're going to have 10 squared minus into negative 9 all squared. So this guy equals to 10 squared that is simply 100 minus minus 9 all squared that is simply positive 81. So 100 minus 81 that is equals to 19, which is what we have on the right hand side of this guy. So indeed, this second solution is true. 
so that's it see you in the next video